let's fire up the Leggero pizza oven for the first time. For the burn off, we're gonna let this go for 15 to 20 minutes on high. And yes, if you're noticing, this is sitting on my 36 inch Blackstone, that's because I'm limited on space on my porch. With this model, you can use batteries or the electric adapter. I am hooked up with the electric adapter and I am running off a 20 pound propane tank. So the question is, can this fix a frozen pizza? Well, we're gonna find out. I'm gonna go ahead and add some seasoning onto the pizza. This is what we like. So in the instruction book, it says not to put a frozen pizza directly on a hot pizza stone because you will crack the pizza stone. So I'm gonna let this sit out on my table while the oven is preheating and also doing that burn off. So this has been going for 20 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and launch that frozen pizza. This is semi-frozen. Notice I had no semolina flour. You don't need it when you're using a frozen pizza. You may be asking yourself, why am I cooking a frozen pizza in this pizza oven? And that's because when this pizza oven arrived, I only had frozen pizza and I honestly did not feel like messing and playing with dough. I honestly made the mistake by walking away and grabbing a drink inside and I come back and this is what I came back to. This only takes a couple of minutes. Don't walk away. I honestly thought because it was semi-frozen that it would take a little bit longer to cook. I think I cooked this about 600 degrees. Some of you may like pepperoni and pizza like this. We do not like burnt pepperoni, but this was our first cook. Bye guys and I will see you in the next video.